the main thing we were looking at is a comparison of the, um, the incidence data, say for example for blacks compared to whites. And at the youngest age groups, um, ages 45 to um, 54, that's where we see the, the largest disparities from blacks to white. And they have um, two and a half times the stroke rate. Um, blacks have two and a half times the, the stroke rate uh, than of, of whites. But then as you get older, it, it decreases with older age so that by the oldest age group, ages uh, 75, the whites have a um, uh, higher stroke risk than blacks. Stroke is a preventable disease, and so no matter what uh, your lifestyle characteristics, your family history, um, you need to pay attention to uh, getting uh, regular checkups and getting uh, your risk factors monitored. Um, hyper, if you have hypertension, it needs to be under control. If you have diabetes, you um, want it to be under control. Um, no matter um, what, what part of the country, and access to care is very, very important to, to be seen and evaluated for stroke risk factors. As, as we go through and study the people who had a stroke and those people who didn't, we'll be looking at um, what are some of the factors. And so again, it's, it's a little bit of uh, uh, preventing the risk factors and how were they treated once they had the risk factors and then when they had the stroke. So we can also look at some of the, um, uh, what happens to them after they have a stroke. Um, do they get better risk factor control because the message is, I've had a stroke, I don't want to have another one.